from a station working for you. This is a WRTV update. I'm WRTV's Amanda Starr and Tino local USPS workers say your mail is being delayed like never before and some trucks are leaving empty. Nearly every morning trucks leave the Indianapolis Post Office on South Street, but Indiana postal workers say because of new cost cutting measures put in place by the US Postmaster General, trucks are not full like they should be. The newly appointed postmaster mandated that every truck keep to its schedule even if it is empty. It's meant to improve efficiency and reduce overtime and extra trips. WRTV investigates reached out to the Postal Service, which said, quote, on-time transportation has gone up from 89% to 97% in a few weeks, end quote. And a new update on how the COVID-19 pandemic is impacting Indiana. The Indiana State Department of Health reports 897 new cases of the coronavirus. That is 17 more new cases than the state reported Sunday. To date, a total of 94,196 Hoosiers have been diagnosed with COVID-19. There are also five newly reported deaths from the virus. 3,077 people in Indiana have died from the coronavirus since the pandemic started in March. 1,076,947 Hoosiers have been tested for COVID-19. 8.7% of them tested positive for it. Kevin. Well, let's talk about the next three days. Our daily chance for showers and thunderstorms will be there with the best chance, I think, Tuesday and Wednesday. Thursday, 82 for the high and the rest of the forecast. You get to the end of the week, lower humidity, comfortable temperatures, and we dry out for Labor Day weekend. Amanda? Thanks, Kevin. Find our latest stories and forecasts anytime on the WRTV app and WRTV.com. Have a great evening.